Hello everybody, today we will create this lens flare effect. I created a simple scene for this to show you how to create it. Okay, if you have your rendered image, um, go to the compositing, enable use nodes, search for a viewer node. Do we need three main components? One glare node set to ghosts, increase the irritation to four and mix to one. Then you need to increase the threshold, but it depends on your image. For this render, a threshold of five is okay. And now we need to isolate it a little bit. Search for uh, an exposure node, plug it between the render layer and the glare node, and type in minus four. But also this depends on your image or render. Okay, and now we need to combine this layer with the original image. So we need a mix node, set it to add, and plug the rendered image to this. The first step is done. And now we need two more glare nodes. So duplicate it and set it to streaks. Increase the iterations to 5, the mixed value back to 0, and to isolate this again, we also need an exposure node, so duplicate it and plug it between. Decrease the exposure value to minus 10 to see better what we are doing. Then duplicate this glare node again, also decrease the fade to 0 0.875, and increase the streaks of both glare nodes. Now we need to combine this layer with the original render, copy this mix node and plug it between the last glare node and the viewer node. Now you see this, it's too bright, so it's clipping. And for that, we need to reduce the intensity. So search for a hue and saturation value, plug it between the mix and the viewer node and decrease the value to something like 0 0.1. Decrease this exposure value back to 0 0.1. And now we need to mix them. So again, search for a mix node, set it to mix and 0.5 and combine both. Okay, now this clipping effect is back. Just duplicate this hue saturation value and plug it between the ghost glare. Okay, and if you want more quality of this lens flare effect in the light source, increase the quality of both streaks to high, but it takes more time. Also, if you want this effect much more in focus, increase the fade of both nodes to 0 0.95 and 0.94, for example. And you can increase the threshold if you want to isolate it more to a specific point. If you want to increase the strength of these little light dots, you can copy this exposure node and plug it between and set it to something like 2. Yes, this is a very good technique to create a lens flare effect for renders. This also works with animations, but if you want to animate it, like you can see now, you have to take care of the values and maybe you have to animate the values as well because this lens flare effect works best in the edges and the corner of the image. If the sun is right in the middle, this effect is much too bright. Okay, that's it. And I hope you enjoyed the tutorial and it was helpful. See you next time. Bye-bye.